Hi guys, welcome to Tech Trust with yet another video. In this video, I want to uh, show you how to install a dot appx or eappx encrypted version of the appx file using PowerShell. So actually, appx files can be installed just by double clicking the file, especially if you're using latest version of Windows Store. Now here you can see that dot appx file of this sharex. You can actually double click and install it right away. You don't actually need to use PowerShell. However, in case you want to use PowerShell for e APPX, or maybe sometimes you want to try this um, for some odd reason, you want to use PowerShell, right? Whatever. It may be EAPPX or APPX. If it's an EAPPX file, you can actually double click. In, in that case, you will have to use PowerShell. Maybe in the near future, uh, Microsoft may add this feature. Anyway, so. Just what you needed to do is just right click on the start menu and click this Windows PowerShell then as an admin and you have this PowerShell here. So here you can see that uh, it's better to keep this file in the C drive so you don't get any error. And also make sure, you know, if you keep it in a folder, just name it using, don't use any space. If you use some spaces in the folder name that actually causes some random errors here, you can see that. I have named appx installation files with um, spaces in between the words right so anyway now here is the uh, file in that folder just what you need to do is just uh, copy this uh, url location url then go to partial then add this command appx package add hyphen appx package then paste that url then add a backward slash and just copy the name of that particular application appx file with its extension then just copy if you don't see the extension uh, of that particular file on your pc all you needed to do is just click this view and tick this file name extension so you can see that it's gone so if you tick that you can see the appx extension there so just copy the name with its extension then on the PowerShell after this backward slash just paste it then click enter now here you have a an error that has to do with the folder name so if I change the folder name it will go without any errors so you need to make sure your folder name is single name or names with hyphen not any spaces between them so I'm going to change that here and some people may get this error they might wonder what's going on here because they, ha they have a folder named after you know something else they want but uh, nobody will think that this folder name is causing the problem so here what I'm going to do is instead of space I'm going to use hyphens so and open that folder and again copy the location from there and again I'm going to add add appx package okay and paste the URL and add a backward slash at the end of that location then copy the name sorry then copy the name with its extension then add that at the end of that file location in the uh, PowerShell then click enter this time you can see that it's installing without any problem So after installation you can just exit That's gone and here you can see the application sharex So that's how you install uh, APPX or eAppx File using PowerShell. So I hope this helps. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos tips and tricks like this and thanks for watching